And those places will be emotional or physical abuse or both. Am I lying? You need an educated man. For an educated man will know how to escape poverty. An educated man has an understanding of patriarchal system. An educated man understands feminism. And an educated man understands how to learn. He, he, he scarred a tad bit because at the end of the day, it has nothing to do with someone's education. Okay? Mm -hmm. Because if someone is going to be emotionally abusive, that has nothing to do with their financial status. I know this for sure. <laughs> let's, let's go to number five, man. Let's make All sure right, we got five, this thing five. here. And this thing here set up, man. Video number five. Okay. Uh, what is that? Video number five. We got a dude who speaks his mind on why women shouldn't date uneducated men. He says that an educated man will know how to escape poverty. Is he right or wrong? Let's see what he says. Let's see what he says. <laughs> it's this jump podcast. Oh. Let's go. I'm so sick of people getting bad advice. And one of the worst pieces of advice that I hear all the time is don't date a broke man. Wrong, wrong. It's not don't date a broke man. Don't date an uneducated man. For when he is intellectually he inferior, he will Damn. assert his dominance in other arenas. Let me say that again, because y'all need to jot that down. When no. he is intellectually inferior, he will assert his dominance in other arenas. When he can't match your intellect, when he can't match you in conversation, when he can't really Sound like somebody you, just scarred him. He can't really he's, he's yeah. talk, he will assert his dominance in he other hurt. arenas. His strength somebody will hurt show him. up in other yeah. places. And those places will be emotional or physical abuse or both. Hmm. Am I lying? Yeah. You need an educated man. For an educated man will know how to escape poverty. An educated man has an understanding of patriarchal system. An educated man understands feminism. And an educated man understands how Did to you learn. Say understands when you feminism? deal with an uneducated man, you're dealing with a man who never had to be a student. You can't teach somebody who has never learned how to be taught. You're always a student. So he all, in life, you you're always a student. Broke. What is he talking about? Do different for you. <laughs> but an educated man will get it. Especially for women, y'all are getting degrees at higher rates, which means you're escaping poverty at higher rates, which means you're making more money. A and it degree means don't mean nothing. Superior. So if he's not beating you intellectually and financially, where else can he beat you at? Okay. Yeah. All right, well, now, hold on. I'm not. I'm not, I'm not, what, I'm not who, who says he talking to men or women? <laughs> I'm, I'm not feeling this. So it sounds like he he's he scarred a tad bit because at the end of the day, it has nothing to do with someone's education. Okay. Mm -hmm. Because if someone is going to be emotionally abusive, that has nothing to do with their financial status. I know this for sure. Nothing to do with it. Nothing at all. So if he wants to talk something and, and, and say that someone's intellect and then they're going to put their dominance in other areas, that goes for anyone, not just men. That's women, too. There's women, too. So what's someone's education or level of education? Look, now these days we have all these people, as he mentioned, getting degrees, but they can't even get jobs. But then nine times out of 10, and, and, they, and they say this, it's always the C students that are the bosses over the A students. So what does oh, yeah. that tell you? Yeah. What does that yeah. tell you? I think it will, I don't want to say it because I don't want YouTube to get on my ass, but uh -oh. I'm, I'm just going to leave that alone. I think that he is misspeaking or he has misspoken because it seems like he's talking about uneducated men, but I think he's talking about men who ha don't have morality. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because I mean, you, it, you can be educated with no morality. You can be uneducated with no morality. But if you don't know right from wrong, then you know what I mean? You, you got you got an issue. Yeah. Because I, I mean, mean you, you can be uneducated, but it, but you, you can have ambition as a man. True. You could be willing to 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 learn because i mean shit, remember back in the day i mean black men we weren't allowed to have have an education so what we you're telling me is that it, it, that all people, even men period. back then yeah all black men, men back period. then was what was, was beating a wife shit we was too busy getting beaten <laughs> right <laughs> we, we can't beat nobody we was getting beaten right if, if he's talking about general general men then then he's no, completely he can't, wrong he, can't, he definitely cannot generalize yeah you can't thing. generalize that you, you you're complete because i know listen i know people who don't have who got a GED? <coughs> I know some people who don't have in high school who who are well off financially and have very good morality. Mm -hmm. But then I know people who have master degrees, doctor degrees, and are shitty people. Yeah, it's, shitty it's people. It's about the upbringing, the background. Like it has not has nothing to do with just education. So for him to just 
single out education in how a person acts or responds or treats people, he's totally wrong. Yeah. He's totally wrong. Yeah. Totally. You know, I mean, now, again, for the women out there, I don't think you should be dating men who are, I'm who don't have ambition. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Who aren't willing to learn. I mean, because again, you don't really don't know people's position. Maybe as a young child, he had to take care of his family. He, he, he couldn't go to school and he had to, shit. Listen, T Pain <coughs> dropped out of high school it's and he's a considered a that I know musical genius. It's quite a few people that I know personally that, that to this day are grown adults don't have diplomas or GEDs or, and are suce- successful business owners. It, look, I looked up a list. 10 poorly educated but incredibly successful people. John D. Rockefeller. Okay. Horace Greeley. John Glenn, the astronaut. Steve Jobs of Apple. Mark Twain. Henry Ford. Look, and Steve Jobs is rich. William Shakespeare. Winston Churchill. Abraham Lincoln. Albert Einstein. All over the place. Albert Einstein. You know what I'm saying? Now, we want, we, we, we want to go black. Too many white people for you. We go black. Okay, let's go black. William Shockley, American inventor, physicist. Okay. W. E. B. Du Bois, founder of NAACP. Lewis Terman, American psychologist. Look, so and Black History Month is coming up, so they'll be teaching y'all all this stuff. Exactly. You know how they how they do once a day, you know, try to point out a black person, even though Black History should be every day. Exactly. And who said it right there? Education doesn't make people act right. It doesn't. It's all about morality. You know what I'm saying? It's not. It's all about morality. Treat people the way you want to be treated. That's it. That's it. That's just that's that's the way to live. Right. You know, isn't that what they call the golden rule? You know, hey, listen, I, I, I had treat a friend of mine. people the way you want to be treated. It's that I, simple. I had a friend of mine who all he dated was women with low self esteem. Oh wow! He so loved it sounds it. like he wanted that control. No, because he said that was easy, easy skins. What? <laughs> Again, control. You know, that was easy pickings. Yeah, control. If, if that's what you want to call it. Yeah, that sounds like control. Oh, okay. Yeah, it sounds like control. Hmm. Of course, a from a man, from man's perspective, you wouldn't say that. Because <laughs> us men, we gotta look out. We gotta look out for each other. I man, we gotta look out for each other. This general podcast, man. <laughs>